you know, really horrible things happen to really nice businesses and domains expire. And I've seen some crazy things when it comes to domain names. So let's make sure you're prepared and protected with your domain. So we're busy business owners. We got lots on our plate and domains expire. There's a credit card associated to every domain name and they will expire. And as it comes down to the wire, you may or may not be getting emails from whoever hosts your domain, that's going to expire. So what happened? So one of my clients took a whole team up to some off the grid retreat. And of course, what happens? The domain expires and a competitor in GoDaddy especially, you can go right up behind. So when that domain expires, the next person can boop right in and takes the domain. What are you gonna do now, right? Bad news when you get back from this digital detox retreat. So here's kind of my hit list of what you need to do as soon as you find out that your domain has expired. Number one, call your host right away. Make sure that whoever, so it's a GoDaddy or whoever's hosting your domain, not your website, your domain, whatever you registered your domain, you wanna make sure if you can get it back, you immediately go in and get it back. Buy at least two to five years on that domain, very important. So once you do that, make sure it's set on auto renewal, plus two to five years on top of that. So that will never happen again. The next one is if you're already in there up, re-upping your domain, buy the misspellings of your domain. My name is Heather Lutze, L-U-T-Z-E. -E. I also own heatherlutz.com without the E, and I have a lot of other different variants that I own. So if you know your website domain or your name of your company gets misspelled a lot, make sure to buy the misspellings so that you are covering them even when they get it wrong. Then ultimately, if someone else has got your domain name, you're gonna to have to then probably get an attorney and then start working through them to negotiate a deal to get the domain back. I have seen this a lot and it happens a lot. So just make sure that you protect yourself. Make sure to buy ahead on your domain three to five years. Make sure that you're buying the misspellings of your domain so people can still find you even if they spell it wrong. That you know um, who hosts your domain and that you know your logins for that, very important. And finally, that you know who to turn to when your website goes down. So if that's not your web designer, it's gonna to have to be your host or the domain name registrar like GoDaddy. So your domain name is your fingerprint online. It is absolutely critical to the health and reputation of your business. Don't leave it to chance and definitely protect yourself from being hacked. Did you like the content that we just gave you about your domain? Well, there's so much more to come. Make sure to subscribe to our channel, hit the bell so you get notified of our daily videos. Hey, and you can also check us out at findability.com where we empower businesses to get found online. Whoa, whoa.